Today, we're having a maximum security vault building competition. I'm going to build a vault that no one can steal money from. I'll build one right here. Then I'll build mine somewhere else. I think I'll build mine over here. This is where my maximum security vault will go. First up, I think I need to make the entrance. Ah, I'll use these commands to make a really long tunnel here for the vault. Next, I'll install lots of security systems to try to keep Mikey from breaking into the vault. For my first security system, I'll make a pond of security guardians. Now I'll use a command here to make a lake appear. Something like this. Nice! I made a lake! Next, I'll place blocks of stone on the side so it's easy to get out. Then, I'll use tripwire hooks on the sides. Like this. When someone gets caught in one of these tripwires, a swarm of guardians will appear in the lake. I'll go around back. Like so. And hook up a redstone circuit. Just like that. I'll set up the redstone dust. Then, I'll hook up the circuit to a comparator. And place the dispenser here. And finally, once I fill it with guardian spawn eggs, it's complete! So now, once the tripwire is touched, a swarm of guardians will fall into the pond, and the guardians will attack! To avoid the security system, all you need to do is swim underwater to avoid the tripwire. And you'll be okay! I wonder if Mikey will be able to get through my security system without setting off the trap. If Mikey makes it through this, my second security system will be a pop quiz. So now, over here is where I'll set up my security system. I'll write a question on the sign. Huh, what kind of question should I use? What kind of question is likely to trip Mikey up? Hmm, what's good? Oh, I know, I'll use this. 1 plus 2 times 2 equals what? Yeah, I'll have him solve 1 plus 2 times 2. You need to multiply before doing addition, so he'll need to do the 2 times 2 first. Therefore, the answer to 1 plus 4 is... 5! Then, I'll put a button beneath it. There. And on this side, I'll put 6 here for the wrong answer. And then I'll add some doors. If you press the button for the correct answer, the door opens, like this. But if you press the button for the wrong answer, the door won't open. Hmm. And to top that off, I think I'll have the button for the wrong answer set off the security system. Next up, I'll install turrets into the walls. I'll move this wall back and place the power source down there. I'll place the turrets right here, place laser rifles on them, and fill them up with ammo. Now, as you can see, I'm placing the rest of the turrets. And on the other side, I've set up more turrets. For the next step, I'll close up the walls with stone. Now when the button is pushed, I want the turrets to activate. So I'll use commands. With this command, I can spawn command blocks. Which I'll use with more commands to remove the stone walls. With the commands inputted... It's finished! When the button for the wrong answer is pushed, the door won't open, the turrets will appear, and proceed to fire. I wonder if Mikey will be able to make it past this pop quiz security system. Okay, moving on. Over here, I'll make the ultimate choose a path security system. Haha! <laughs> a little of this. And in an instant, I've made an empty pit. Next up, I want to fill this pit with lava. I'll use a command. 
Just type it in like this. And now it's a lava pit. And now, I'll place two blocks. And I'll leave a pile of diamonds on the left side. Then, on the right side, whoa! I'm leaving a monster! For my next step, I'll leave a chest here too, and inside that chest, I'll put a pickaxe and three blocks of stone. Mikey will need to choose between the diamonds and the monster. If he chooses the correct one, he can continue on. The next thing I'll do, over here, is place a door and lock it. I'll give the key to the monster. I'll hand it over. There. Now if Mikey chooses the monster, it will hand over the key and he can move on. But if he chooses the diamonds, the monster will get angry. And it probably won't go well for Mikey after that. Next up, beyond the locked door, I want to make an attack zombie security system. Now, I prepared pressure plates and stuff for a redstone circuit. And I'll leave the piston right here. Next up, I'll place the pressure plates here. And I'll hook it all up with a redstone circuit. Now, when someone steps on a pressure plate, booyah! It's set up so you won't be able to go back. Now to cover this up. I will hook up another redstone circuit. I've dug it up this far, so over here, I'll place stone blocks. I'm placing a door in the wall and locking it. Next, I'll set up a dispenser over here and connect it to the redstone circuit. Putting a comparator here. Now to close this up. Inside the dispenser, I'll place five zombie spawn eggs by placing these inside, I can make this an attack zombie security system. Will Mikey be able to fight the zombies and escape the room safely? Once the zombies are taken care of, a key will pop out for him so we can move on. And to wrap it up, I'll leave a chest, and inside, I'll place a single golden apple. Moving on, I'll build my vault at the end of this tunnel. I'll open this up and place some sturdy blocks of iron here. I'll put some behind this, too. Just like this. I'll place these blocks of iron. And here I'll use sticky pistons. And connect it with a redstone circuit. This is what it looks like when it's closed. That's the entrance to the vault. Now to set up the vault itself on the other side. I'll use a command like this. Hey, hey, I've safely built my vault. With that, it's complete. Next, to make my security even stronger, I'll leave a gatekeeper here. Hmm, yeah. I choose a mutant zombie. I'll have this massive mutant zombie act as the protector of my vault, yeah. You can't enter the vault without beating the mutant zombie first, so my security system is much stronger now. Next, I'll fill up the vault with treasure. Just like this. I prepared lots and lots of cash. Then, on this side, I want to fill up the wall with gold coins. I'll place these all over the wall. Just like this. All right. Next, I'll leave some very expensive clothes in here. Whoa, the inside of my vault is finished. 
Now, in addition to the treasure in my vault, I'll set up an explosive security measure. I'll make the door here and use a command to make another tunnel. And like so, I made a tunnel. Now, on the far side, I'm going to build my explosive security area. A little of this. Good. This will be my explosive security measure. Right here, I'm placing observers. And then I'll start placing diamond ore. Next, I'll set up the TNT. It's set up so that if someone digs up these diamonds, the observers will cause the TNT to explode. Okay, that should do it. I've covered the TNT with plenty of diamond ore. If someone mines the diamond ore, a massive amount of TNT will activate and explode. All right then. Oh, that's right. I should make the entrance to the explosive security zone set to be off limits. I'll place the doors here and then surround them with iron bars. Next up, I'll mark it with do not enter symbols. And the signs will read keep out. When Mikey sees that the area is off limits, he'll get curious and definitely try to enter here. And with that, my vault security is complete. Let's go see how Mikey's doing. Mikey, did you finish your maximum security vault? Check it out! It's so full of amazing security systems that I think it's absolutely impossible to steal the treasure. Whoa, I can't wait to see it. Let's get started. All right, give it a shot. The vault is beyond this tunnel. I wonder if you'll even be able to reach it, JJ. There's a pond in the way, though. There's a treasure chest, too. Uh, something suspicious about this chest. It might be part of the security system. Of course not! Open it! There might be something good inside. Hmm, it's pretty sus. But, well, I might as well open it. Here I go. Three, two, one. Open! <laughs> Don't! Ow! What was that? Whoa! All right! <laughs> Pufferfish popped out! <laughs> you fell for it! When you opened the chest, it activated the security pufferfish! Touching pufferfish makes you take poison damage. Uh-huh. Huh, what should I do? Do you give up already, JJ? No way, I'll force my way through. That's impossible! The next time you touch a pufferfish, your health will bottom out! You should just give up! I don't have any other options. Impossible! You can't do it! Okay, get a running start, and go! Ah! <laughs> yes! Made it! Whoa! Wow! You actually defeated the pufferfish lake! <laughs> yes! I made it through without taking any damage! Wow! What's inside of this chest? Time to find out! Open up! Whoa! Woohoo! Bread! Great! You got bread! I'll eat this to recover my health. All right, on to the next room. Here's the door. Open up! Huh? There are a lot of chests in here. And also, the door's locked on the other side. That's right. You have to search this room for the key before you can continue on. Wow, this looks like it'll be tough. Huh, I guess I'll start searching for that key. Oh, not in that chest. What about here? Hmm, no keys in here. Not over here either. Difficult, isn't it? There's no key here either. I don't think you'll ever find it. What about this chest? Hmm? Nope. Hmm. Uh, hang on. Hmm? Huh? There's something sus about this chest. Of course not. It's just a regular chest. No, Mikey. On closer look, the block underneath this chest is different from the others. No, it's normal. This is an extremely suspicious chest. I'm curious about it, though, so I guess I'll see. Open. Ah, uh, uh, a zombie popped out. Yes, yes, yes! Woohoo! That chest released a security zombie! Duh. Still, if there's only one zombie, I can probably defeat it! Go, zombie! 
If I punch it like this... Can you beat it? All right! Ah! I fought off the zombie. I can't believe you beat it! Yeah, that's true, but... But finding the key is harder than you thought it would be, right? Mm-hmm. There are too many chests, so searching for the key is tough. Can I maybe have a hint? Hmm? Hmm. It's a tough one. Hey, there's a raised ledge over there. And there's a chest on it. The key might be in there. Let's check it out. No way! No way! Okay, up the ladder. And, yep, something's definitely up with this chest. Really? Time to open it up. Three, two, one. Huh? There's no key in this chest either. Oh, too bad. Hmm, this is really hard. Uh, there's a bridge. Huh? Hmm? Huh? There's something on the other side of this bridge. Let's check it out. Huh? You're going over there? Uh... Huh? Huh? A hidden chest. I bet the key's in there. Oh! I'm opening it. Three, two, one. Open. Whoa! Ah! Woohoo! The key! All right. I defeated Mikey's security lock. Oh. I'll use this key to move on and steal whatever's in Mikey's vault. You saw through my secret chest security system. Now to use the key to open this door. Open up. Huh? Wow. This is Duh. Duh. There's a huge pit keeping me from going forward. That's right. It goes all the way into the void. It's a giant pitfall trap. Duh. I wonder if you can make it across. Uh but still, I might be able to cross using that slime. I'm gonna try. Can you make it? Okay. All right, jump! I made it! Woohoo! Wow! Amazing! Hey, hold up, Mikey. There's another hidden chest. What could be inside? You saw that? Okay, I'm jumping onto the chest to check it out. I'm gonna look inside now. Hmm. Here I go. Open. Whoa! A weapon and some armor! Oh! All right, I'm equipping a full set of iron equipment. Hey, hey! All right, back on the ladder. Now, finally the vault. But there's a wither skeleton in front of the vault. That's right! It's the vault's gatekeeper. You won't get in the vault that easily. That's okay, though. I'll use my new weapon and armor to beat it. All right, I'm taking out the wither skeleton. Come on, let's go! Oh, it dropped something. Huh? A lever. Could this be the key to opening the vault? Whoa! Let's find out. I'll put it here. Oh. Open up. Yes, the vault is open. You opened it. All right. What an amazing treasure. So many diamonds here. Amazing, JJ. I might as well admit defeat. Why don't you try mining the diamonds right away? Huh? Hurry! See that? There's even a pickaxe for you. I lost. Aw, I totally lost. Hmm, I see that, Mikey. There is a pickaxe here. Yep. Hmm, I'll just grab it. Yep, yep, yep. And mine those diamonds. You might as well. Unless... Huh? There's something bothering me. What is it? Nothing to be suspicious about in here. Hurry and get those diamonds. Mikey, there are pressure plates down there. No, there's not. No, there really are. This isn't right. I'm gonna check it. Uh... Huh? <gasps> hmm. Aww. 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 See? There was TNT all along. <laughs> Which means, if I were to try to get those diamonds and step on the pressure plates, your TNT system would have activated. Huh. You figured it out. Huh. And that was my last resort security measure. All right, that's better. Hmm. I've deactivated the security system, so now I can safely mine the diamonds. Oh, my diamonds! You broke through my TNT security system. Woohoo! I got the treasures from Mikey's vault. Oh, it's all gone. Now it's my turn to go against your security vault. I'll definitely steal the treasure! I set up an extremely strong security system. First, there's a lake. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Hmm. 
Hmm. There doesn't seem to be anything dangerous in the water. <laughs> This'll be easy. All I have to do is swim across, right? That's way too easy. All right, here I go. Woohoo! Oh. Uh, uh. <laughs> huh? What? There's some kind of weird fish raining down. Ah, <laughs> uh, those fish are called guardians, and they are extremely dangerous. Ah! Mikey died. What just happened? Look carefully, Mikey. There's a tripwire just over the water. No kidding! I never noticed. I set off the security when I touched the tripwire. Hmm, do you give up? Hang on, hang on! There must be a way past this. Oh, I know! I should dive and swim under the tripwire. All right, I'll just swim underwater. Whoa, impressive, Mikey! Whoa! Ho ho! I crossed the lake without tripping the wire! You defeated my first security measure! Woohoo! What do we have here? Is that a math problem? Huh? One plus two times two! Oh, JJ! This math problem is way too easy! Who could ever get this wrong? <laughs> you sure seem confident! First, one plus two must equal three! Then three times two equals six! So, the answer is six! Easy! All right, if that's the answer then, I'll push the button for six. Ready for it? Click! Huh? What? Ow! Oh, no way! Ooh, what's going on? No! Why? Why? Ah! Ah! Ow! Aw, Mikey got flash fried. Isn't it six? Mikey, the answer is five. Five? You need to multiply before you can do the addition. Oh, now I understand. Six wasn't the answer. Five was. So if I push the button for five, okay, woohoo! I can move on. Oh! I know what this is. There's a monster and a pile of diamonds over the lava, and I need to choose which one to save and which one to drop into the lava. Right? Yeah, Mikey. Save one and drop the other into the lava. Hmm. Oh, there's a chest. All right. What could be inside? Huh? There's a pickaxe and some stone. Yep, Mikey. Diamonds are the monster. Which do you save? And which do you drop into the lava? That's not even a choice, JJ. I gotta save the diamonds. Which means... Sorry, Mr. Monster. Sorry. No. Okay. Next, I'll use stone blocks to reach there. Okay. Woohoo. I got the diamonds. All right. No. The monster came back out of the lava. What's it gonna do? Diamonds are so cool! Mikey, behind you! Huh? What was that? <gasps> ah! Ah! Aw, the monster took its revenge on Mikey. So I wasn't supposed to choose the diamonds? Mm-hmm. I don't want to lose the diamonds, but I guess I'll save the monster. Okay then. Goodbye, diamonds! Oh. Aww. And now to save the monster. Plop, plop, plop. Okay! Huh? What? Whoa! Huh? Oh, hey! Mr. Monster's happy! Oh. Huh? What's this? I got a key for something! Mikey, look at the door on the far end. That door needs a key. No kidding! I know! It needs this key! Thank you, Mr. Monster! I'm moving on! Here I go! Yeah! All right! All right! I'm coming too! Now use this key! Here goes! Three, two, one! Whoa! It opened! Yay! Ho-ho! All right! Okay. Huh? What's with this place? There's no security here! Is this okay? I'm moving on! Huh? Ah! I'm trapped in here! <gasps> Mikey, you're trapped inside this room. What now? Huh? What? Ah! Those are my security zombies. Ah! Zombies? Can you survive them, Mikey? <laughs> What do I do? Ah! Huh? 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 What? Oh, wow! The monster!
monster I saved earlier rescued me! You're really strong! I never expected the monster to take your side! You defeated my security zombies! Thank you! Huh? Oh! A zombie dropped the key! Woohoo! I got it! Oh, and there's a treasure chest! What could be inside? Wow! There's a golden apple inside! Woohoo! And now, using the key I just got, I'm opening this door! Three, two, one, open! All right, I'm moving on! Mikey got through my security! Oh, I see the vault, JJ! It's over there! Yep, the vault is where my treasure is! You've done well to come this far, Mikey! <laughs> However, I have a super powerful gatekeeper watching my vault! So unless you can beat the mutant zombie, you won't be able to open it! Mutant zombies are really strong! But JJ, I have a powerful ally of my own, so I'll be okay! Huh? Hey, Mr. Monster! Go fight that mutant zombie for me real quick! Oh? Wow! That monster is heading for the mutant zombie! It's so strong that I'm sure it'll be easy! Attack! Huh? Uh, uh, what is it? <gasps> hey! Why did you run away? Mr. Monster is so scared of the mutant zombie that it lost its nerve and ran off! <gasps> no way! Oh, I know! I know! I know! Huh? Maybe if Mr. Monster eats a golden apple, it might power up! Eat this, Mr. Monster! Here! It ate it! Oh! Uh, wow! Mr. Monster looks golden now! Did Mr. Monster actually eat a golden apple and transform? Huh? Huh? Oh! It's going back to fight the mutant zombie! Whoa! Go, Mr. Monster! Whoa! Whoa! You took out the mutant zombie! Thanks! Seriously, you broke right through my vault's security! Which means, JJ, that I win! I'm stealing the treasure from your vault! Aww! All right! Oh, there's a lever! This must be it! Ugh, you made it all the way to my vault's entrance! Yes! Aww. Well, I'll be taking all the treasure! You broke into my vault! Oh, wow! You have this much treasure? Expensive clothes, too! And stacks of cash! Oh, and so many gold coins! Yay! This is all thanks to you, Mr. Monster! Let's take as much as we can! Impressive, Mikey! Grab the expensive clothes! All right! You actually made it through all my security! Oh, yeah! Let's grab it all! Wow! What an amazing treasure! You actually emptied my entire vault! All right! But you haven't taken everything yet. Huh? What do you mean? There's even more treasure? I don't see it anywhere. Are you hiding it somewhere? There's nothing left. Huh? Huh? What's this? It says to keep out. I feel like it must be beyond this door. Oh? Huh? Could it be? There must be more treasure through here. Let's go in. You can come with me. I'll use that pickaxe from earlier. Oh, no. All right. The door may be blocked off, but I can break through to get in. All that treasure will be mine. <clears throat> All right. You can come with me. Booyah. Let's go. Yes. I tricked Mikey right into my final security measure. Uh, Mikey, wait! It said that this place is off limits! You were hiding more treasure in here! All those diamonds belong to me! You can steal them if you want to, but you'll regret it, Mikey! That'll never happen, right, Mr. Monster? Hm. All right, all right, I'll be taking these! I've got the die. What?! If you enjoyed today's adventure, make sure to like and subscribe. Plus, you can check us out on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok whenever you want with the links in the corner. Thanks for watching. See you next time.